few days back I have uploaded some video about Microsoft Word and then I uploaded some video about uh, article design that I have uh, started to design in my computer uh, using Microsoft Word. So as you know, uh, you guys know that I have uh, made a header portion and I have made some simple design for these articles. I have made some paragraphs and some headers, subheaders, and different different kinds of header and footer for different pages. So if you guys don't you don't uh, yet uh, visited those videos, so you guys are requested to go and check those videos out. So this was basically the article I have uh, designed uh, designed uh, in my previous some previous videos. So today I'm going to add a picture. This uh, this article is looking super plain, right? So I need to add some pictures here. Uh, like this is a paragraph, and I want a picture here. You, you you may notice that the articles contains lots of pictures, right? So in in articles, actually the PDF versions of article are the articles actually contains a lots of images, and it just makes those articles that design more attractive to user. Uh, otherwise, it will be boring, right? Uh, Besides reading the articles, um, it's 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 a uh, it's, it's actually a psychology that people love to uh, visual, people love to visualize something than reading. So if you add any images, it will be more attractive. So to add any images, as you know, you have to go to the insert tab, and here you can find uh, the option that is called the picture. Click here and browse some sorry select some pictures from your desktop storage so i'm going to add insert this picture okay So my cursor was there. Uh, my cursor was actually here. So this picture actually uh, uh, wasn't fit here. So it just uh, go to the opposite opposite page. So I'm going to delete and again insert another picture. I want a picture like here this side. So first I'm going to again do the same thing. Insert the download option. Select this picture. So as you can see now, this picture uh, didn't fit. And go to the another page. So I'm going to resize the picture. As you know, if you click here and just drag it inside, it will be smaller. And if you click here and, and drag outside, it will be. The picture will be resized to bigger uniformly and if you want an uniform kind of resizing then you can you can just click here and drag outside or click here or drag, drag inside i have shown you uh, shown this in my previous videos okay then but this is not looking so good as you can see uh, it, 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 it there is uh, there's some so many spaces and my writing starts from here and it, it's not looking actually good so to to place your pictures at the right places there are option here that is position okay so if you unclick it will be it will be gone but if you click here if you click on the picture if you select this this tab will appear that is the format tab Okay, again, I'm going to show you if you click here, a new tab will be appear that is format tab. Then you can find a uh, option that is position. Then here are some options where you want your pictures. So, okay, so if you click here, it will be at the, um, at the top left uh, to the, the picture will be placed at the top left or to, uh, sorry at the top left corner of your pages if you click here it will be placed at the middle of your page middle top of your page 
to the right top of your page at the middle middle of your pages and this is the option that <clears throat> the picture will be placed at the middle right corner of your page and i think this is okay okay yeah this place is looking it's fine here this is fine here it's looking good here okay you can also resize your pictures here right so yeah uh, it's okay no the I can put here you can also you can also place your picture like you can also drag your picture and place a little bit left or place it a little bit right this is perfect I guess uh, no this one is the most perfect okay now if you want to remove the background like you don't want this 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 background that you just want this this like this only the structural picture you don't want this sky so how to remove the skies uh, without using any kind of graphical tools uh, if, if, if like you don't have any graphical knowledge but you want to remove these backgrounds so how can you do that uh, it's easy to do by using only Microsoft Word. You can you can do some simple editing using this tool. So you have to again double click or select the picture simply, and you can see there is an option that is remove background. Okay, as you can see, there are two options: mark area to keep and mark area to remove. So if you click here, mark area to keep. If you click here and just whenever you place your pen it, and it will keep that portion it will keep that portion from your picture the pen will keep that portion from your picture i want this portion as well maybe this portion okay i want this structural portion i don't want the sky portion so i have cut in the structural portions and i want to keep this and this simple place here keep changes and as you can see the background has been removed the the sky has been removed from your background okay keep this oh sorry okay so in this way you can uh, actually remove your background as well Make it a little bit smaller so that it will look good. Okay, so yeah, in this way you can add any kind of structural picture, remove the background of the picture as well. So if you want to keep the background, how to do, I'm going to add another picture here and I'm going to do the second option here. Like adding the picture again from my computer. Uh, let's add this picture. insert okay sorry i'm going to place my picture not in this page the next page okay then position again at the left okay now just click here and you can uh, find the options here okay now we <clears throat> if you remove background remove some background you have to click here and sorry you have to click here and in the area you will mark that will be removed from your that will be removed from your picture as you can see that portion has been removed and only this portion is remaining okay so in this way you can or i can you can use these two tools uh, the keep keep the portion you want or remove the portion you don't want you can do do this with on um, with only microsoft word it's very easy and simple and you, you just need to uh, you need to do some tasks okay uh, so yeah that's all for this video i don't want to make this video so much longer 
so I will do some more work with pictures to edit something and I, I will uh, do the rest of my work for this simple article till then uh, please check my next videos as well I will upload my rest of the videos very soon so that you guys uh, you guys can easily check and you, you don't have to miss my videos so if you like my video don't forget to give a thumbs up and please subscribe my channel bye for this time